How does your period affect your skin? During your menstrual cycle, your skin may fluctuate between periods of dryness and oiliness. You may have realised that your skin is the most problematic during your period or even a couple of days prior to it. Imbalances in sex hormones such as progesterone, estrogen and testosterone affect oil and sebum production and hence the condition of your skin. During the first few days of your cycle, estrogen and progesterone levels are low. This results in dry and dull skin. Wrinkles and fine lines may also appear more obvious. During this period, moisturising is crucial to maintain hydration levels as well as the structural integrity of your skin. Estrogen levels gradually rise during the follicular phase of your period, which is typically the first 10 days of your cycle. Testosterone levels also rise and your skin will experience more natural moisture and collagen production. Next, ovulation typically occurs around day 14 of your cycle. Your skin may appear clear and bright for the next couple of days until testosterone and estrogen levels begin to decrease again. At this time, progesterone levels rise. This closes skin pores and induces sebum buildup beneath the surface of the skin. Luteinizing hormone levels also increase during the luteal phase and your skin may become more prone to bacterial overgrowth. These factors jointly increase the risk of acne. This phenomenon is also commonly known as hormonal acne. If you suffer from hormonal acne, lifestyle modifications such as good skin hygiene, a healthy diet and taking care of your mental well-being are key. If these alone are not enough, speak to your doctor to find out more about specific skincare products that may be suitable for your skin type. Finally, for stubborn hormonal acne, your doctor may also choose to start you on oral medications or hormonal therapy. Speak to us here at Radio Medical Aesthetics to find out more. We have new videos weekly, so remember to subscribe to our channel and other social media accounts as well.